Hey everyone, in today's video, I wanna show you how to update your number on iMessage and FaceTime on your iPhone. If you recently changed your number, for example, this is how you would change it on your phone. Let's jump into the settings. I'm gonna show you two different places to do it. Most likely you'll have to do it on iCloud and then I'll show you how to do it on your phone as well. So on iCloud, you see your name on top right here. Go ahead and click your name and it's gonna take you to this page where you see name, phone number and email as the first option, click that. And on here where it says reachable at, you see where my number is listed is associated with iMessage and FaceTime. This is where you would change it. So press edit. And right now, if I press I next to my phone number, it says the number is being used for iMessage and FaceTime, but I have to turn off iMessage and FaceTime and try again. So I wanted to show you where it's at, but now let's go to the places that it tells you to change it. Let me go back to settings here. Again, on the first page of settings, we want to scroll down to get to FaceTime and messages. You see those two options. So let's click messages and turn off iMessage. You just slide that right on the top right. Now iMessage is turned off. Let me go back and FaceTime. Click that and turn off FaceTime. So now that they're turned off, I'm gonna slide all the way back to the top, click my name, and then click name, phone number, and email. Now on this page it says reachable at, my phone number is no longer here, but I could press edit, and then I should have an option to add email or phone number, press that, and then say add phone number. And now you could type in the new number and the country code here, and when you're done, press next on top. And now the new number has been added. So now let me go back to settings here. Let's go back all the way down to messages, turn back on iMessage, and then let's go back to FaceTime and turn on FaceTime. And right here, you could see under FaceTime, you can be reached at and your phone number is activated here, the new number you just added on the other page. And same is true with iMessages. If you wanna change your number on your local phone here, if the iCloud option doesn't work, there's the phone option right on top of messages, press that. So here, my Apple Watch actually got the update too. I'm gonna to press okay, but you see my number right on the top of the page. I could go ahead and click this and I could go ahead and edit my number here too. If you wanted to add a new number right here to the phone, I recommend doing it right here if this does not have the newest and latest phone number associated with your phone. But between those two options, everything including iMessage and FaceTime will have the new phone number associated with them. I hope this quick video was useful. Make sure you give it a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel for easy to follow tech videos and I'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching.